Antonio's given up the location of a huge stash of cocaine hidden in Mojocoyo. This could be the mother load. Get in there and take it out. Hmm. Right, hello. Tis I, Frost. Welcome back to the Ghost Recon Roadlands episode. This is part 27. I've already marked this out, but this is the next mission because I didn't record in time. I didn't have to press record, whatever, right? So I've already marked this. Hello. I, this is a big bay, so honestly, if I get rid of the alarm and that new dad helicopter, I'm just gonna rush in. After I take out this guy, he's pissing me off. There we go, lovely. What's suspecting me? Oh, okay. Oh, hello, you're right there, fuck it. God damn. Didn't come up in the mini map, so I didn't know. Right, I wanna get rid of that alarm as soon as possible. Fuck off. No, no, don't tell me that was the only dead helicopter getting alerted. Okay, good. This soul, there's an unidad helicopter kicking about. That's gonna make this ten times harder. Where's the alarm? It's over here. Want to take it the alarm? I can just rush in and murder everyone. Where you got Next to the get across that would be quite nice nomad but no pressure get rid of them too Roger. Well, let me get a good two attack. guys up there we can get rid of Roger that target marked target marked Okay, first let me get the alarm before you spot me, alright? Don't keep you spot me now because the alarm's gone, but... Hmm, okay. Just outrun it. Okay, I'm gonna guess there's a lot of people underground. That seems like a kind of place you'd store cocaine. I imagine. I, I don't know. Yeah, it looks like it's underground. You're a person. I hate when the civilians like get in the way. How do you take so many bullets? I hate when like the civilians get in the way of like all your shots. We find the main stash. Yep. Sure as fuck did. Now we gotta take it out. Okay, so this must be the stash. Oh, hello. Frag out. I'm gonna guess it's all these white boxes. Is it? Yeah. Is that a restock? Yes, that is lovely. Okay, apparently this one didn't. Apparently these don't break. Okay. 
Right, well that's off in this mission, so yeah, I'll see you at the next one. Antonio's wife Gabrielle is in trouble with the cartel. If we extract her, she might be able to help fill in some of the gaps in our knowledge about the cartel. Great, okay. We need to rescue the wife Gabriella, who's in a chop. Oh, there. We search in this location for intel. We're moving. Stay behind me. Ya pues, vamos. I'm gonna take her on the Lambo because why not? Go ahead, I'll catch up. A nice car for a nice woman. You know what I mean? Ah, uh, of course. Here's an idea. What if I just go around? I knew I never should have thought you in. Yep. Bye. Oh, okay. The problem with the Lambo is because it's like dirt roads and stuff, like it's finding like main road, but because we're going up dirt roads and shit, it's all slidey and stuff, so, oh, it's not very good, but it's still fast, much, okay, I'll just say that, taking a shortcut. I'm assuming it's going to be a cutscene, so I'll play you guys here that I'll unplug my mic and then we'll move on to another province because this is the final mission. Oh well, okay. I just fucked up, but doesn't matter, we can just get a new one. Oh, oh, oh okay. Okay, let's try to be a bit careful. You know, we want to be a bit careful. It's always good to be, you know, it's a tiny bit good. Our, our windshield might be a bit fucked up, but you know what? It's, it's, it's the price of an extraction. Right, well, it's going to be a cutscene, so yeah, we'll finish this and then I'll see you in the next province, I guess. You're never going to see Antonio again, ever. He's on his way to a prison in the United States, where he will spend the rest of his life. For the next 70 years, he will stare at the same walls, he will piss in the same toilet, and he'll have the same conversation with himself until his brain finally breaks. Life is over for him. You, on the other hand, have choices. If you want, you can leave right now. Of course, we both know they will kill you before you even cross the street. What if I don't know anything? Look both ways before you cross the street. Bowman, we're entering a province called Espiritu Santo. Espiritu Santo is the base for Sueño's religious propaganda. Key to that is a woman named La Santera, a self-proclaimed Santa Muerta priestess with thousands of loyal followers. That witch has an uncanny ability to turn men with guns into fanatics. That's the shit that keeps me up at night. Narcos have been into Santa Muerta for decades, but most worshippers aren't cartel. That's a small mercy. You got an angle on changing the mind of a fanatic? You're gonna need to dig for intel. Find out how to take down La Santera in a way that will demoralize the Sicarios and turn the regular folk away from the cartel. When she loses her congregation, bring that witch to me. Bowman out. Destroy the gold caches given by the cartel to run the cult in Espiritu Santo. No doubt El Sueño's faith in La Santera will be challenged. Okay. Guari Main. We need to. Well, we found it. It's going to be in there. There. Destroy the cash. Okay. We can do that. Just blow up, I guess. Shut it down. 
Oh, fuck off. Of course, it, they just come at the last time at all, don't they? Let like that pass. Let it pass, okay. Ah, oh, fuck me sideways, okay. As long as the... As long as the thing doesn't come back, it should be fine. The yeah, helicopter is gone now, so it's not going to come back, but... Hmm, okay. Oh wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Oh fuck, there's a time on. I wanna... Go. I wanna see if that's like, anything cool happens. Oh, I think that... I think he's dead. Is he dead? Yeah. I think he's dead. Oh no, he's still alive. Oh, half of it. Right, okay, well, we're not going to do that. We need to kill someone else next. We'll do that next episode. But yeah, I'll see you guys when we actually have to kill someone. So I'm going to be honest, I actually do not know the best way to approach this. I feel like it'd be not smart, but kind of... Alarm over here. You've got the alarms. Reinforcements won't be flying. Okay, well that's the only alarm. So if I clear out the one stealth and then if need be I'll have to go guns blazing because... So this is the other, oh fuck. This is the other gold mine. So if I just get rid of, I figured I'll just get rid of both of them and then do the kill the pastor type guy next and then just end the video there. But So the mine's somewhere down here, I think. Because, well, unless someone's up the mountain, that's down here. There's also a plane there I can take for escape. But I want to clear out the back here first. I'm seeing two narcos here. Right I don't know if that's a smart move or not. The alarms are down, so I'm not expecting any trouble from like a helicopter or something, but What's cartel run? Oh that's a United helicopter. Who else? Let's shut it down. Uh, why do they always show up? Like, must they show up? At all times? If I... Did you gonna let out someone? Okay, no he didn't. Cool. Did he? No. Great. Okay. Sorry if you can hear that by the way. Someone's like power washing or something. So if you can hear that, I'm sorry, but... If not, okay, I think they're at a far enough distance that they shouldn't be able to hear the explosion. At least I hope so. Enemy marked. I'm seeing the sandbag in placement, see? We're There's good. someone down here. I don't know how bright is it? Okay, it's actually pretty bright. So I don't know, okay, I say that uh, not as bright again. There's a minigun here, I'm taking that in case we got spotted, but we didn't. Just one person? Oh, you right at the back. Oh, there's two. How did you not see that? Oh. Okay. What? Right, and then bolt. No, don't get stuck. Bolt. Oh. No. 
Nomad. Okay, yeah, we're fine, but... And now, we watch as it all comes down. And what do you know, they're still not alerted because they are... Well, they are quite a distance back, so it's not really bothering me. But yeah, guys, I'll see you at the next mission, I guess. Esteban Ibarra is La Santera's advisor and the cartel's point of contact with the cult in Espiritu Santo. It's time Ibarra met Santa Muerte face to face. I'll let you arrange the introductions. Right, so what about here? I'll turn off the radio, but... We're about here, so... Oh, oh, okay. So there's a guy in the parking lot, we'll get rid of him first. As soon as the parking lot, you know, you don't just have cars or a car park, whatever. You don't just have a bunch of, yeah, you don't just have a bunch of cars placed there for no reason. Okay, so if I, I just kind of drone out a little bit, it's jammed. That's not where I meant to go anyway, that's a different area, but not a different area, but like a different kind of building. Right. Hey now, got a group of Sicarios. Where you got it? Inside the Santa Muerte Church. I see a team of Sicarios here. I don't know if it really matters if they get spotted or not, because I don't know if they like runs. Ah, well, they held it anyway, so. Time to go loud, I guess. Well, he's dead, but. Now he's dead. Fun. I'm gonna clear us out then, end the episode here. I think. Another. No, no, he's dead. Okay, well, he's dead. So. Alright, well, he's now dead, so that's fun. Well, yeah, guys, that's gonna be all from this one. If you did enjoy, be sure to give a thumbs up, and yeah, I'll see you all next time. Peace. Oh, fuck, there's a helicopter.